JR is doing right now is indexing the cam profile to the camshaft itself. And this is Talon's 272-2 profile. Actually, just checking back with the paperwork, it says that we're doing the 260 grind for Talon. What we're doing here is indexing the to ensure that the camshaft lobe is put back in original location with the modified profile. Just realigning the tooling to the camshaft before we grind. If a camshaft is off index a degree or two, usually that ends up being about 20 thousandths of base circle. And once you put a modified grind on there, we're already going to be diminishing the base circle, so you want to maintain as much base circle as possible. You want to verify that you have accurate indexing before you grind. What we did there was just switch the, the indexing to the different firing order of the number three cylinder. See how we're removing the bottom part of the lobe, which is called the base circle. As we grind the base circle down, it increases lift and duration. Cylinder, cylinder number one. doing here is now going to put a real fine dress on the wheel for the finish cut. That was just the hogging cut that we did there. 
Run the diamond dresser very slowly across the wheel surface to put it back to zero. Nice and smooth for a glass like cam load finish. Over here is where the tooling actually goes. The index plate right here has the firing order laser cut into the index plate. So each cylinder is exactly in true location to the other cylinder. Once you go from like one, the first cylinder, number one to two to three to four, they're all exactly cut in phase with one another for true and exact firing on the engine. Again, this cam was ground custom for Talon uh, for the D-Series group by dseries.org. And it's done, ready to go to quality control.